Hey everybody, Jay here. Welcome back to the homestead. We are in the heavy Chevy and we are going to get some uh, topsoil for our gardens this year, our planter boxes. We're doing raised beds this year, either three or four of them, not sure yet, but planting season is just around the corner here in New Hampshire and we have some friends that have a homestead that have some donkeys, some horses and cows and every year he's constantly building up soil and he has different piles as far as manure, dirt content and he's got some pretty much ready to grow um, topsoil that we're gonna uh, load in the heavy Chevy and then we're gonna load up our uh, bins for our uh, planter boxes so yeah stick left. around and uh, hang out should be a fun video so we'll see you guys when we get there We're just heading out. I got free dirt and a free beer. Not bad. I ended up staying for a couple hours. Um, they're good family friends of ours. But anyways, um, this is some good stuff. You can see in the corner of the frame there. This is good dirt. It's perfectly colored. It also um, was the only pile that was frozen. He's got three different piles there. I don't know if you noticed, but he's got three different piles there. And this pile was done giving off heat because in the winter time it had snow on it and it froze. So that's a good sign. He was telling me that uh, it was done composting. It wasn't releasing any more heat. So this is perfect dirt. I'm happy. Um, that's pretty much a wrap. Again, just trying to be a little bit more self-sufficient. So we got, you know, probably a full bed load, as you can see here, 
full bed load of dirt uh, and whatnot. So that'll be handy for you know our planter boxes. We're gonna do uh, a little corn section on the uh, playground there, a little corner of the play area that the kids don't use. Um, we're gonna go ahead and plant some corn there. We're gonna do some sunflowers in the back too. We got a few things going on, but anyways, just want to bring you along on this little homestead journey. But this. This dirt will treat us well. After um, you know, every year we'll add to it. We'll add some dirt, or we'll go back and get some more. He's always going to have some. So this is a nice contact, and it was free too. I've seen anywhere from seventy-five. Uh, I've seen anywhere from seventy-five bucks a yard. You know, depending on where you go. There's a difference between loom and actual dirt that you can grow in. Loom is just dirt with no you know fertilizer in it. As you saw, he's got every animal under the sun so appreciate you guys watching let me know what you think a little bit of a different video here but i figured i'd share with you um but yeah anyways thanks for watching and we'll see you guys when we get back uh on the homestead so thanks for watching leave a comment leave a thumbs up if you're happy as me to get dirt let me know <laughs> it's, it's the uh it's the small things in life that uh make you happy so getting a free trailer load of poop makes me happy so <laughs> thanks for watching guys we'll see you later